Hi Taurus, welcome to my channel. This is the next 24 hours love intuitive message and general situationship tarot reading session for you Taurus. I hope you are well. I hope you're fine. I hope you're safe wherever you are right now. This reading is for you. What can I get for Taurus please? What is the love intuitive message and what is the general situationship tarot reading session message for Taurus, okay? Before I start, <clears throat> excuse me. Before I start, I start Taurus. I would like to thank you for coming back. Thank you so much for your support. Thank you for everything that you do in my channel. Thank you, <clears throat> guest viewers. If you haven't clicked the subscribe button in the bell, please do it now. If you are interested and if you are keen, and if you would like to further support my channel, Taurus. Go to the description box below because in there, you'll find the details of my Instagram account. Connect with me there, please. Check out the website. In the website, you will find that we have uploaded three new products, okay? Um, those products, it is uh, free shipping worldwide. It comes with a free reading from me. So type your question, type your manifestation, and I will get back to you, Okay. So this is the next one for hours. Love intuitive message and general situationship tarot reading session for you. This is for Taurus. What is the message for you? What is ready for you to know and meant for you to know? Okay. All right. Let's start the reading for you, Taurus. Um, the first card is you've got an ace of pentacles in reverse. You could be dealing with a Capricorn, Taurus, or a Virgo. You've got King of Cups, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, Energy, and the Lover's card, Gemini. Okay, there was a missed opportunity. I'm really getting like this is around, this is between November, November month up until January month. There was a missed opportunity in love. Okay, it could be a Gemini, it could be a Gemini, it could be Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. If you're dealing with this sign, uh, you're most likely will resonate in this reading. So there was a missed opportunity. This person is coming back to you. They have um they they will offer a sense of maturity. They're the king of cups, they will say sorry, they will take accountable of the fault, the issue, the error, but some, someone is coming forward with a very loving heart, okay? So um, if this person shows up uh, between now up until the immediate future, you know, between now and then in the next three months, um, it, it and if you like them, you're interested with them and you have forgiven them and they've forgiven you, please show the real deal, the real feelings of you, okay? Because... Um, they're very sincere, they're very genuine, and they would really like to establish a connection with you, okay? It's a heart-to-heart -heart talk, okay? It's a missed opportunity. They're sad that you guys weren't able to have the Ace of Pentacles. Harmony. I don't know, maybe you fight. There was a brutal fight. I'm hearing the word a brutal, uh, a brutal, a brow, a very messy fight. Ace of Pentacles, King of Cups. I have learned my lesson and I'm, I really want to reinstate my access to your life, Ace of Pentacles. It's 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 very pink. Look at the Ace of Pentacles. It is surrounded by the pink color and the yellow color. So it's coming towards you with harmony. They don't want to be criticized. They don't want to judge. Let's just move forward. Let's let's you know hold hands and uh, move forward to 2021. Very loving energy. Okay, they will be very sad if you reject them. Okay. The second reading is that you've got the High Priestess, the Five of Swords, and the Eight of Wands. Okay. So, heavy, heavy stalking. Okay. If you are stalking someone, they're also stalking you. So, this is... You both are stalker. <laughs> um, you're quiet. They're quiet. You're stalking them. They're stalking you. So, what you and this person is giving... To one another in terms of energy it's not good okay um you would know if this breathing resonate with you because you feel intuitively you feel in your hunch in your gut that they're also stalking you they're also thinking about you and you're correct so you're manifesting each other in a very low vibe energy underground look at that eight of wands in reverse um also, you're manif manifesting this person in a very sad, like you're looking at their photo and 
oh i hate you i don't like you i you know this that um that growl that you feel that bitterness that pain that hurt you need to shift that if you're manifesting someone um and you would like them to return you need to think of good you know happy thoughts you know yep we had a mistake you said this i said that it can be forgiven you know that's you know because yeah manifestation works the good and the bad so make sure that your thought is happy and positive if you manifest because it it you know it it's 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 that's what you put outside of um your being your physical being each one of us is is you know emits energy so you put if you put an energy to the universe i'm manifesting them i'm stalking them because i love them i miss them i forgive them i long for them then the universe will bring you back this unbitter person because you might manifest them back but you're manifesting them bitterly then you you got uh you got a failure you know you're close to failure so yeah change the vibe change the vibe of manifestation um and then the third reading is you've got the ace of cups the king of wands the chariot card okay uh this is a very fast offer okay there is an ace of cups the king of the king of cups you've got something to say they've got something to say this is someone you dated this is someone you dated, they're contemplating on to text you, what to text you, what to call you, how to open up that they would like to bring the Ace of Cups with you. It's not going to happen overnight. I see this coming into fruition after February 8th for some of you. There is an ex or you dated an on and off for some of you. February 8th onwards, um, they're bringing towards you. They're not sure. Ace of Wands. Look at them. This is them. I want to action and bring forward an ace of wands i want to flirt and then turn them on and then make them like me again but that's immature so i need to really change my dynamic in order for you taurus to accept the ace of cups so they're very strategic they will do the first step first step forward first step forward expect them um if you're resonating on this if you feel like this is yours um this person is stubborn Okay, this person is stubborn. Um, you are most, it's it like the connection between the two of you, you're more of a chaser kind of thingy. Um, this time around, it's going to be the reversal. Uh, they're quite stubborn, but they're giving up that ego, that stubbornness because they're a king right now. And um, they still have a little bit of ego with them because if you reject them or you play hard to get with them, Taurus, they will go away. They will be very sad if you play Cupid, play hard to get. And um, they will stay for a couple of, you know, chasing, you know, following up. But then they will think like, mm, there's so many fish in the sea, star, you know, they, I have options. Okay, I don't want to force you if you want to play Cupid with me. Okay, you know, they will try to do the playing Cupid and follow up, but they won't stay long okay you're dealing with a person who they're they're a good catch this person acts is actually a good catch they have a nice face pretty face they're a good catch it's so easy for them to turn on someone when it comes to love very attractive personality very cheerful very charming okay that's why it's so hard for you to resist the ace of cups so here they are february 8 onwards i'm getting i'm seeing that date um a, a timeline a time frame for you Okay, and then the last reading is that you've got the Four of Swords in reverse, the Hierophant card, the Four of the Five of Cups in reverse. Okay, this seems to be I'm getting too vibe. I'm getting like um Four of Swords, you know, general. Um go and get more sleep. If you aren't able to focus at work or something, go and get more sleep, okay? And then the Hierophant card you have a contract or a paperwork to do read it carefully before you sign it off you know it doesn't hurt if you read it twice or you consult someone of an expert to read the documents okay mercury will retrograde so be careful on your decision making back up your data or whatever you sign and then five of cups in reverse don't be sad about something a person that you feel like they've been avoiding you this weekend they will message you there is a two of cups look at that two of cups 
um there is a mo there they will find time for you this weekend so cheer up because there is um a surprising um, message two of cups it's it's a loving energy so this is you thank you so much for tuning in thanks for being here it is a pleasure doing this reading to you guys i will see you soon again bye